We're looking at homework for section 6.1. This is question number 22. A paint manufacturer uses a machine to fill gallon cans with paint. One gallon equals 128 ounces. The manufacturer wants to estimate the mean volume of paint the machine is putting in the cans within 0.6 of an ounce. Assume the population of volumes is normally distributed. A. Determine the minimum sample size required to construct a 90% confidence interval for the population mean. Assume the population standard deviation is 0.68 ounce. B. The sample mean is 127.25 ounces. With a sample of size 5, a 90% level of confidence, and a population standard deviation of 0.68 ounce, does it seem possible that the population mean could be exactly 128 ounces? Explain. So the first thing we need to do here is find that minimum sample size for part A. In the minimum sample size formula, we have N equals ZC times sigma over E squared. With a 90% level of confidence, the ZC value is going to be 1.645. So we have 1.645 times 0.68 over 0.6. When we multiply out the numerator, that's 1.1186 divided by 0.6 which is 1.8643333 squared. And when we square that, we get 3.47573878. Rounding up to the nearest whole number, we need at least four. So the minimum sample size here is gonna be four. With a sample of size five, we have at least four individuals, so we can proceed to part B. Now we're finding the confidence interval. To find the confidence interval, we need to find the error. Error equals ZC times sigma of X bar, which is ZC times sigma over the square root of N. The ZC value is 1.645. The sigma is 0.68. And N is 5. When we multiply this out, we get 0.50025312279. And we're going to go ahead and round that off to two decimal places, which is 0 0.50. Now that we have our error, we can compute our confidence interval by doing x bar minus the error and x bar plus the error. The x bar value that we were given is 127.25. So it's 127.25 minus 0 0.5, 127.25 plus 0.5 which is 126.75 to 127.75. And that is your 90% confidence interval. So based on that 90% confidence interval, what that confidence interval means is that we're 90% certain that the actual population mean falls within this region. So we were asked the question, does it seem possible that the population mean could be exactly 128 ounces? Well, we're 90% confident that the population mean should be in here, and 128 does not fall within this interval. So it doesn't seem possible that that population mean could be exactly 128 ounces, because 128 ounces falls outside of the confidence interval. And that's our answer.